The holidays are here and we have some awesome gifts here on the table. We do, and they would be perfect for the overlander, camper, or off-roader in your life. And I cannot wait to open up some of these. It's so cool, there's some great stuff here. I'll definitely put the happy in somebody's holidays. Welcome to Trail Recon, I'm Brad. I'm Regina. And today we've got all kinds of great holiday gift ideas I think you guys are really gonna enjoy checking out. Yeah, a lot of these will make the perfect present um, to add some comfort and convenience to your next adventure. And while these are absolutely not necessary to have a great time on the trail, well, it's the holiday season and these are gifts, so they'll just take things up another level. Yeah, I think anybody would love to have one of these sitting under the tree. I know I would. Is there one that you want to uh, start with? You know, I've kind of been eyeballing this one, so yeah. I'll take this one. Can I shake it? Ooh, it's kind of heavy. wonder what's in here. So I think you're really gonna like this first gift because you enjoy cooking at camp and I, this one is gonna help us where we get to enjoy it a little bit. Yep, so normally I wouldn't open a gift in our house until I've given it a good shake and I've made a guess as to what it is, a legitimate guess, because it just, for me, prolongs the magic of Christmas morning. So this yeah. is the Full Windsor Magware set. This is really cool. We've been using this for a while. We have, absolutely. What and is it you like about this? What I love about it is the utensils are different colors, so you never lose track of who's who's. They're multi-use, so you're not throwing plastic away and you know, kind of polluting the landfill. These are better for the environment. And I also love the fact that they're magnetic, so when you are putting them away or pulling them out, they stick together and you're not dropping them on the ground, which you know, some of us are butterfingers, and this comes in really handy. Spoon, knife, and fork. I think you're really gonna like this one. Um, I know I like it because it's gonna add to our peace of mind when we're out having adventures in uh, remote locations. Okay, I think I know what this is. <laughs> you're not supposed to know. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. So this is the Berna SD Kinetic Launcher. This is really cool. The neat thing about this is that you can have a little bit of fun We're doing some target practice, but right. it's also going to allow you to have some protection when you're right. in remote areas, specifically against like wildlife. And so what this is, is this is a launcher and it has these kinetic balls that go in this five round magazine. And that magazine, drops down in here, you load that up with these kinetic balls, which are really hard balls and you do not want to get hit with these. <laughs> no. But if you had some kind of animal that you didn't want to come into camp, you know, this could deter them from doing that. Also in here are some, what they call eco-kinetic balls. These are actually food grade. They're made out of food. Okay, and so, so you can eat them if, as the last one. I don't resort. know if I would <laughs> eat them, but the good news is if you're out yeah. there doing target practice with these, uh, they biodegrade. I actually okay. tested it. I actually yeah. took one in water and it completely dissolved. Oh. So you're not gonna make a mess if you're out there goofing around. And this runs off of CO2 cartridges and these CO2 cartridges get installed here in the center. Once you insert that CO2 cartridge in there, you pull the trigger on the very first one, that's when it actually punctures the CO2 cartridge. And so when, you're in, when it's in here and you haven't used it, you don't have to worry about that CO2 cartridge going empty or depleting or leaking. So it's really, really neat. Nice. You've shot this. It's kind of fun. There's not like any kickback or anything no, with it. No, and what I really like about it is it's non-lethal. Yeah. You know, we don't want to hurt the animals. Yeah, definitely want to make it go away and uh, go enjoy its time elsewhere right. while we're enjoying our time in camp. The great thing about this is, you know, you can, you can take this to many other places where you can't take other things that we're not going to talk about. <laughs> but the Berna SD launcher is a great gift idea. So you know how they say you should never give your wife a blender or a vacuum cleaner <laughs> oh. for Christmas? This is one that, you know, okay. I think is a great gift because you're going to get a lot of use out of it, but ah, it's very practical. It is incredibly practical. I know what this is. Yep. So what's in here is the Insta Privy portable toilet kit. So this is a complete all-inclusive kit. This has everything. It comes in this great durable canvas bag. Right, and I love it because you can just throw it in the back of the Jeep for a day trip. Um, that way, if you can't find a rock, like or a tree, which often happens in the desert, um, yep. you have a place to go. Yep, and it's got uh, backpack straps on here so you can throw it over your shoulder if you need to walk out, you know, yep, yep. quite a ways. And it's got a handle on here, it makes it easy as well. Yep. And then there's all kinds oh of goodies gosh. in there. What do we it's got in there? Oh my gosh, it's loaded. Okay. okay, so we have waste bags, 
which you can also buy biodegradable ones, but these are great. They're very durable and sturdy. Yep. So in here is a thick bag and then there's a bag that goes in the bag. Yes. And then there's a little kind of an absorbent, a, absorbent pad. pad that goes in that bag. And right. so then you take care of your <laughs> business. <laughs> It's always an interesting conversation when we talk about we this. We do have a full video explaining more about how to use it yeah. and how to dispose of things. Lots of bags in this kit, so you're good to go. What else we got? Uh, we have two bags for storing. I like the, that you gave me the pink one. It's a good color on you. <laughs> for storing the waste bags because you aren't always near a garbage can or a dumpster where you can get rid of them properly. Right. So this kind of hangs hangs onto them and uh, they're waterproof just yep. in case something leaks. Right. Lots. And lots, lots of, of toilet paper, lots which toilet is paper. biodegradable. Right. Um, Brad will demonstrate this later, but this is a privacy tent. I'm gonna I'm gonna start doing this now while you're talking about that. Are you? Okay. Yeah. So this this flies open, <laughs> and then, whoo, you put this over your head, <laughs> and then you kneel down over the toilet. You don't kneel down. You just squat. You just squat down you over squat. the toilet. Don't kneel. <laughs> and this is the toilet, which is obviously the best part. Um, it's very strong and durable. It folds up super compact. So when you're assembling it, you put the waste bag in here and you fold the seat down around it. But this is really durable. It's got four legs and it doesn't fall over on you, which happened to me one time using one of the ones with the tri legs, the tripod, whatever you call the thing. Um, something you don't want to have happen when you're going to the yeah, bathroom. It's really good material, but it does fold it's down. It's very compact. Really nice which and flat. That's what we love about it. Yeah. Am I forgetting? There's a shovel oh, in there. Yeah, just in case. Yep. And, and wait a minute, it comes with hand sanitizer uh -huh. and toilet seat covers just in case you've got some friends that you're sharing with that you're yep. not that good of friends. Yep, 100%. We talk about, you know, pack it in, pack it out. This is a great tool to make sure that that is something you are living by. Absolutely. And this, you truly are, you know, when you don't use the shovel and dig a hole, you're truly packing out everything that you packed in. Yep, so uh, there you go. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's go see what That's else what we got. That's what I wanted. So I got one for you. And I got one for you? And okay. they go together? They go together. All they right. They go together. So we're going to open these up. Uh, oh, yeah. I know what these are. Hey, no fair. Mine has started up around. Yeah. So this is the Ignic Growler. And in here is a small portable propane tank that comes in a really, really nice case. And, and this I really like is it. the Ignic fire can, which that makes work. Yep, you can use this, this growler because it comes with, I'm just gonna pull this out. Okay. So the case is really cool. The case is what I like a lot because I can throw it's it in the back of the, around. I can throw it in the Jeep or throw it in the trailer, but you got this small, <laughs> ah, you got this small little propane tank and then it's got the hose here so this is great because um, a lot of places that we camp, there are burn bans and you cannot have wood fire campfires, which kind of sucks, but this... <laughs> you're making a mess <laughs> over here a and, and a lot of noise while you're talking. But Sorry. pretty much anywhere we go, we've been able to use this, which is awesome because we can stay warm on a cold night or a cold morning. And it's just great to gather around a campfire when you're hanging out and there's stars overhead. It's just really a primal sense of enjoyment. Yeah. And no smoke in your face. And no smoke in your awesome. face. No smoke in your face. So this is a nice little compact kit. It's like a little ammo can. It's easy to throw in the Jeep. You can put stuff on top of it. And then it's got these little legs on the bottom. <laughs> and it's got these orange little pads on the bottom. Like you don't have a bunch of metal. That's actually really it's clever. Scraping and scratching. Scraping. Scratching yeah, so when you set it down on something, it's actually really nice. But you got these four legs here. And then you hook it up, open this guy up. And it's really fast when you're at camp to set it up. Yeah. And then light it up and it's quick. Voila. And the great thing about this is when it's time to go to bed. You just turn it off. You, you just, don't have to like stamp on the fire, pour water on it, yeah. do all these things. And it's peace of mind for me because I'm always worried about fire hazards. Yeah, so. for sure. And when we've been out there on a cold night, uh, this keeps us really warm. You get a lot of radiant heat from there and we yep typically don't even run this on full blast. We no. usually run it on about half power, which allows this little tank to actually last quite a while. 
And what I really, really like about Ignic and what they're doing in this tank specifically is we don't have to carry a bunch of those small little right. green disposable propane cans. You can refill this. There's lots of places when you're out in the country to get um, propane refilled like yep. RV places and campsites instead of just farm supply stores i think farm yeah. supply yep. stores all kinds of places and you just don't have to carry a bunch of those little green cans which i really appreciate better for the environment better for the environment we've been using this for a while yep I'm, ex it. I'm excited to have another one so that's pretty cool <laughs> all right all right see what else we got yep all right so this next gift i know we said that these gifts are for comfort and convenience but this one is really for practicality and safety and um, i'm giving it to you because i love you and i want you to be safe oh yeah okay so this is the elements fire extinguisher i have these in all but one vehicle so this actually this works out we'll, your vehicle does <laughs> not have one of these and so we're going to actually take out the standard fire extinguisher that's mm -hmm. in there now and replace it with this the great thing about these there's a lot of great things about these but one is that they're smaller than a standard fire extinguisher, but they last longer. This one specifically lasts 50 seconds if you aim it at a fire. And if you've ever used a regular fire extinguisher, a CO2 fire extinguisher, they are out really quick. And so this one lasts a long time. That also doesn't leave any residue. It's good for several different types of fires. So this is great for Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, and Kilo fire. So an Alpha fire is like a wood fire or a trash fire. A Bravo fire is like for gas cans and liquids. You can use it on electrical fires. It's not gonna Charlie. be corrosive for the electrical units. So if you have a really nice electrical system that you've built, you're not gonna destroy it. I mean, the fire's probably gonna do a little <laughs> bit of that, but you can salvage some of it. And then the Kilo fires are for like oil and grease fires. fires. Yeah, so this is great to have at camp. And the important thing is to make sure whoever has this in their vehicle and whoever's with them knows how to use this. Plus, it's got this mount that it comes with, which you can mount this in all kinds of places. So this is a great little piece of kit. So we live in Southern California, yes. a very warm climate. So we don't do well when it's cold at camp. Nope. And I think this is the perfect gift <laughs> for on those very, very chilly See, nights. This isn't just for me. Mm. This is a gift for you. I don't like being cold. So it's a gift for us. <laughs> okay. It's a gift for us. I guess I can share. Yeah. In there okay. is the Vector Off-Road Down Blanket. Whoosh. And it comes in two bags. It okay. comes in the travel bag. So when you are on the go, you're throwing this in the back of your vehicle, okay. stays nice and compact in there because the down condenses really tight. But then when you're not using it, you put it in this larger bag and that allows the open? down to rest. Open. open that thing. Yeah, that thing's awesome. So we have actually used this yes. many times. Talk about that and how much you like. So it's an 800 fill down comforter, which means it's pretty darn warm and it is a uh, king size because yes. we throw it over our bed. It's we huge. use this. It, yep. I mean, it packs down. The, so the 800 fill means that um, it's high quality goose down and it packs down really, really tightly. Oh, thank you. <laughs> ah. Well, 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 where's my half? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you always accuse me of stealing the covers. She steals so the covers all the time. Well, but we've slept in some pretty cold weather, like below freezing with this. And it has kept us so warm and toasty that I've had to like, you know, kick my feet out just to cool off a little bit. Yep. So when I you, love this. When you first pull it out of the bag, it's going to be pretty flat. But after maybe 15 minutes, these puff up really nice. You get a lot of insulation in this thing. I love this blanket. Honestly, <laughs> yeah. we don't go camping without it. Even in the summer when we're in mountains, it can get a little chilly. So having this is pretty nice. And let's face it, we're from Southern California. So anything below 50, maybe even low 60s <laughs> is pretty cold for us. Yeah, so this makes a great gift, guys. Yes, it does. So one of the best things that we love about going camping and overlanding is those evenings at the end of the day where you're sitting around a campfire. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love, love the front runner camping chair. Yes, you do. First of all, you can get the canvas bag with it, which protects the chair and everything around it. But the chair at camp, look at this thing. It's super compact and watch how quickly this sets up. I love this chair. It's so, I don't know, there's paper in here, so hopefully <laughs> nothing zip tied. We're open this for the first time. Pop it open and bam, you're ready to go. That's quick, right? There's not a bunch of poles to 
mess around with, and it is very, very comfortable. And for me, it's got the perfect leg height. I love this chair. It's solid. It's pretty sturdy. Yeah, the one I've had, I have had for a couple of years. Uh, it lasts a long time. It's very durable, it's very comfortable. Nice got little cup holders. Yeah, cup holder, place to put your phone. Thanks, hon. I really like this chair. I'm glad to have another one. <laughs> So when we are at camp and we're sitting in our chairs around the fireplace, I know you like to have a place to set food down, snacks, uh, and drinks down. Uh, don't forget about my book and my magazine right. and my iPad. Uh -huh. and I think this, this is going to be a perfect Ooh. little solution. I think so too. So this is the GSI Bamboo Picnic Table. Uh -huh. Look how small that thing is. It's super it's, cool. Oh, look at this. You know what those are for? I do know what those are for. So these are nifty little wine glass holders so that you can hold your wine glasses without taking up space on the table. So this is like perfect height where you can just set things down. If you're having a snack, I can put my glasses, my cell phone, chips and dip. Yeah, you're not awesome. setting, setting things down in the dirt. It's level. You're not gonna, you know, yeah. not gonna spill your and drink. It's super lightweight. The top is made of bamboo, so it's really durable. It can double as a cutting board if you need it to. Mm -hmm. So it's definitely a multi-use little table, which is awesome. Yeah, and it, it compacts down really nice, I mean, so you're not taking up a whole bunch of storage. Nope, it folds down pretty easily. Yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, but look, totally easy to use this as a cutting board. Yep, and it's stable. Perfect. Yeah, thank you. It gets pretty dark when we're camping, especially when there's a new moon. And you know, you're not as graceful as I am, so oh. I would hate for you to stumble and fall okay. in the middle of the night. Let's be honest. Uh, uh, yeah. I am way more graceful I, than you are. I'm totally graceful just because I broke my knee playing ping pong. Oh yeah, this is a great light. This is the Nebo Franklin Slide light. This is not just a regular flashlight. This is a 500 lumen flashlight. It's really bright. It's it got will a, blind you. It will blind you. It's got an adjustable <laughs> lens so you can get a wide or a narrow pattern on it. But what I really like is it's got this slide and so you can open it up and you can set that on a table That's somewhere. That's it normally blinds me because I not expect, I haven't aimed the wrong way. Yeah, and if you need to do a repair or maintenance on your vehicle in the middle of the night, you can use this light because it has a magnet on the one side and then open that slider up and you've got plenty of visibility for using this. I've actually been using this light for years. It's rechargeable, so you don't need to worry about bringing AA batteries or AAA or C, batteries which are hard to find. or C, any of that. You can recharge it. It lasts a long time. I have been very, very happy with this light and I'm excited to have another one because this is going to go in the other Jeep. So perfect gift. So we're doing this a little backwards because in our house, the tradition is we do stockings first thing Christmas morning, and then we have a lovely leisurely breakfast of homemade cinnamon rolls, and then we get to open the gifts. But you know, hey. Yeah, so we did all the gifts first, but now we're gonna see what's <laughs> inside here. Uh-huh. And, and let me just mention cinnamon rolls on Christmas morning. <laughs> so good, so good. And you know what goes great with cinnamon rolls? Ooh. <laughs> Some trail recon coffee. So this is a dark roast with a hint of maple and bourbon, mm -hmm. and it's a coarse, grind which makes it perfect at camp so that makes a great stocking stuffer all righty these are the clean freak body wipes which i absolutely adore because when you're on the trail off the grid for several days on end you can get a little ripe and these help keep you fresh and they come in an assortment of different scents. I was going to say flavors, but don't eat them. Definitely do not <laughs> not eat them. flavors. So, but my favorite one is the lavender. It's these are amazing, and I share them with people. And yeah, you know what though? I got to admit, I he likes the lavender. I really like these, and they're nice and large. Like they come in a large little thing, and they're not like they don't have like a ton of liquid on them. Right. So when you it's don't... cold, that liquid just like makes you freeze. These are actually really nice. And so even though they do come in individuals, you can buy them in a little- You can buy a tub, a which tub. is what I usually get. A tub, really. So, but these are great stocking stuffers. It smells great. Okay, uh, I have, oh yeah. So this is the Ignic refillable lighter. Oh, I've seen you use it. So this has got- I wondered uh, what that was. You add some butane in the back here and look at that. Ooh. Nice little flame. <laughs> perfect That's for- powerful. Yeah, perfect for lighting the stove so you can make coffee or lighten that. Uh, the Ignic and stay warm. That's right. So this is a great, I like it's got a little flexible head. So that's a great little one throw in the stocking. Toy, honey. Okay. And, ooh, these are GSI cups, which are amazing because they stack and they fit really nice in my camp kitchen. They are compact and. Can we help you? Can we help you with that? No, I got no, it. You got it. Okay. All right. Maybe. 
They're great little cups. We've been using these for a long time. Um, yeah. Better than a plastic cup. Exactly. Better for the environment because you reuse them, but everybody gets their own color. Yep, I like that. Lastly, Ooh. hand warmers. <laughs> we already mentioned that I don't like being cold yeah, at camp. The here. Yeah, so you got a whole big bag of hand warmers. And then in here, you got individual bags. And these things are great. Throw these in your shoe, throw them in your glove. Once pockets. You, yeah, pockets, in your jacket pockets. But once you open these up within just a couple of minutes, these already are nice and warm and they will last for about 10 hours, which is great. I love having these. Yep. And there's a lot in this little package, so you could divvy them up into your whole family stockings. That's right. So there's our stocking stuffers. So what do you think? I think there's a lot of great holiday gift ideas right here. Absolutely. I mean, there's something for everybody here from small things to big and everything in between and all price ranges. So this is a great spread of uh, ideas for gifts. Yeah. Any overlander or camper, I think would really enjoy receiving one of these as a gift. And just as a reminder, we're going to leave a link down below to trailrecon.com where you can go pick up all of this stuff to make sure yep. that you provide a great gift. And we just want to wish you a very happy holiday season from our family to yours. Thank you for watching. We'll catch you in the next video.